it is sort of pointless. Uh, and I want to... Now, the problem that occurs is that different people experience climate change very differently. It's one thing for a global uh, sort of uh, meeting to define a single objective function in a single variable, uh, mean temperature or, or emission of uh, carbon dioxide. But people don't experience global warming. They experience climate change locally. And because they experience climate change locally, their opportunity cost for reduction of emission is going to be different. And so what you really have, while on a global program, you may say, here's the price, this, this price path. Locally, people experience different kinds of uh, climate change phenomena, droughts, floods, cyclones, so on. And I think from the beginning, uh, we should really have told people how to connect uh, global warming and climate change. Because although at a scientific level, we understand that. I don't think in a popular imagination, people have really connected the greater variability, volatility, unpredictability of climate change with the overall problem of global warming. But what is going to be true is that people are going to look at the climate change problem with different degrees of urgency and different, uh, the different uh, amount of sacrifice that we're willing to make. And we've already seen in the, in, the, in the speeches this morning that that issue comes up again and again. Will the developed countries do such and such? Will the developed countries do such and such? And because they have these very widely differing opportunity costs, uh, it would be difficult to arrive at a single uh, answer.